Up to one three. You want to hear one? We're sitting in Kona, right? Hold short on taxiway golf. Two aircraft behind us. The controller comes back and tells the traffic behind us. Uh, the Alpine traffic in front of you hasn't called you for takeoff. Uh, can you taxi around? And you know, the taxiway is only so big, it's not big enough for something to taxi around. And then the guy goes, no. So as soon as he says no, I turn around and say, hey, Alpine, you know, 480 ready to take off. You know what this knucklehead tells me? It's a whole short traffic landing. Yeah, but he was a fucking Cessna about uh, five miles out. I should have just stopped it for like another five minutes because there was like two airplanes behind us. But that's, you know, it's just, it's just again, that controller, it's just one, one, that one controller up there, head is his name. Yeah, that kind of a jackass. Oh, Andy, yeah, you get up? Yeah. Did you hear what happened? Yeah, I was listening. That guy sucks for him. Hey, man, I called his boss on him before, man. Really? Yeah, there was one time, step by. One time I was, uh, you know, he cleared me for takeoff just as soon as I left the cargo ramp. So I'm going through my checklist, doing everything. And, you know, the taxi, the takeoff point's like a three quarters of a mile up the road, you know, up the taxi way. So by the time I get there, I said, oh, yeah, I'll find whatever my tail number is. I just confirmed that we're still close to takeoff. He comes back over the radio like, Alpine, you know, tail number, you are cleared for takeoff like I'm an idiot. Hold short. Then I took off, and then I called the supervisor when I got on the ground the following day. I don't know where they got him, but...